Hey everyone and welcome to my channel. Today's video is a collaboration that is hosted by Wanda from Miss Amechi and I am the co-host Sierra and this is my channel Just Being Sierra. In today's video I am going to be doing a challenge where we are trying to make something under five ingredients. So it can be five ingredients or less than five ingredients. I've done this before. Um, you guys can check out this video here. It will be linked in my description box down below as well. But I really do want you guys to check out the playlist and then you guys can come back and check out that video. Today I'm gonna to be making something that involves five ingredients, no more than that, no less than that. And this is just gonna be something that I'm gonna to set to the side as a dessert tonight to go along with dinner. So for my under five ingredients recipe, you're gonna need brown sugar, a can of the butter tasting biscuits, as well as four tablespoons of butter, sugar, and cinnamon. I'm gonna go ahead and get my butter together because I'm gonna use four tablespoons of the butter in the recipe as needed. The other two, I'm gonna go ahead and cut up and I'm gonna melt that. With that melted butter, I am going to be putting it into the mini bunt pans that you guys see here. So this little pan will make about 12 and that's great because th this is just the amount that we need um, because we don't have uh, too many to feed. This is just something that I would be able to share with everyone as a sweet for after dinner. I'm gonna go ahead and take the biscuits out. I'm gonna cut these down as much as possible. So I am gonna be using a pizza slicer because it's just easier. You can choose to cut it like this if you want to, or you can choose to cut it twice going down the middle and then twice down the middle um, the other way. So um, it would possibly give you about nine pieces. I'm just cutting and cutting and cutting like little triangle pieces. All right, so I'm gonna add in two teaspoons of the cinnamon into a bowl. This is going to be part of the mixture that is gonna go over top of the biscuits. Not only am I putting some of it into there, I am gonna use half a cup of the brown sugar and also put it in with the cinnamon, but I also am going to add in three-fourths cup of the white sugar and add it in with the cinnamon and the brown sugar. And then I'll be adding in um, two teaspoons um, into the, the bag of the sugar and cinnamon just to kind of give it some type of spice. I'll shake it up just a little bit. And then eventually with the mixture that I made, I am going to pour that over top of um, the biscuits. Meanwhile, I do need to go ahead and melt that four tablespoons worth of butter. That is going to go in along with the white sugar, the brown sugar, the cinnamon, um, and make a mixture that's going to coat these um, biscuits. So I just used about half a cup of the mixture because I didn't want to use too much. I just shook it up really, really well. And here are what they are gonna look like. I then added in the butter with the other stuff. I literally scraped all of it and scraped it together. What you might want to do is do the butter first and then add in the dry ingredients. Might turn out to look totally different, um, but it still worked for me. So if you all do not know by now, I did make Cine Mini monkey bread and um, it was a recipe that I thought would be quick and easy to do in the oven. So you are going to put these in the oven on 350 for about 14 minutes. Just definitely make sure that you watch them. Um, don't let them get burnt a little while into it. This is about five minutes left to cook. This is what it's looking like and so here they are finally after being done. I allowed them to cool for about two to three minutes before taking them out of this pan. 
the leftovers that are surrounding the um, little mini monkey bread uh, cakes, that's what I'm going to call them. Um, I did scrape off. I hope that you all have enjoyed this video and I hope that you all check out the playlist that's linked in my description box down below. I also hope that you all consider subscribing to my channel, giving this video a like and commenting down below if you would ever try this quick, sweet dessert.